That sandbagging operation opened just minutes ago at 8 a.m. and that is available for anyone who may need them to get through this historic flooding. Now, there's also some more good news for people across the county. Officials say water levels at East Lake Toho appears to have peaked. They go on to add the rise of Lake Toho nearby to our west also appears to be slowing down. County officials say other regional lakes like Lake Mary Jane and Lake Hark Lake Cart appear to have reached their peaks as well. This means officials can finally begin to move water out of those lake systems into lower lake levels. Now, as the county works to get these water levels under control, two shelters are operating now to help those impacted by the flooding. Those are both here at Heritage Park at the Event Center and the Silver Spurs Arena. Now, coming up at the bottom of the hour, we'll also talk about another advisory that officials have for folks living near those flooded waters. For now, reporting live in Osceola County, Tony Atkins, West 2 News.